Hello everyone, Dan here from Sherp ET. Just thought I would share me testing out the Sherp at the farm after I did those repairs just to see how everything works and it seemed to work fairly well. Number of different obstacles that I've been playing on here over the last couple of years. Uh, that pond last year was almost higher than that brush pile. So everything is starting to dry out again and coming back to normal. That's nice to hear. That area right there is so muddy. It is that sticky mud that just sticks onto the tires, doesn't allow the paddles to work well. Not fun. I love making waves like that in front of the Sherp. With some different shots, different views. Oh, looks like I'm playing at that pile again. I don't know if you noticed, but most of the time when I'm going over obstacles, I'm going fairly slow. Uh, I'm in first gear and I'm barely giving it any gas. I'm just using the torque of the engine to get over those types of obstacles. There's a back view of the Sherp. This is my dad's fishing spot when I was a kid. Um, in this pond again, there's just bullheads. It freezes out probably once every 10 years and they're all pretty much gone. Um, this spring we had quite a bit of freeze out too because of the water being lower and it was a uh, typical cold winter, um, actually a colder winter than normal, you know, with global warming and all it has been getting a lot colder. Just trying to show the angles on this again, just crazy what that thing can do. That tire, when it just jumped off the ground there, was probably up more than two feet off the ground. When you're in the front seat, you can barely kind of feel that the tire's off the ground. Um, when you're in the back, it is a lot more radical. I think it's just because when you're sitting in the seat, it just you feel a lot more comfortable. The back, you really don't have anything other than your arm holding on to a strap to keep you in place. Well, that's pretty much about it, folks. Uh, Hope you enjoyed it. Just wanted to give you a little bit of the stuff that I was doing. Take care.